Right. As we approach Father's Day, it reminds us of the importance of a dad's role in his children's life. Our next guest offers a special way to celebrate. He comes here every year to tell us all about it. It's his father-daughter dance. So now we welcome the founder of the Ryan Cameron Foundation, the one, the only, Ryan Cameron. Yay! Yay. What's up? I'm so excited to see you. Great to see you too. You always look so good. You Thank always you. are bringing something that we can tell the people about that's going right. to make their lives better. So. 16th year you've been doing this. Yeah, since my uh, my oldest daughter, Ryan Megan, uh, who's watching now at, at work, back to work, mm -hmm. um, uh, is 20 now. So this dance started when she was four years old. I went to her elementary school and it was just like 50 dads and we're all in there and everybody was just like crying. Just, this is the most beautiful thing in the world. I was right. like, you know what? Let's take this to the masses and here we are, you know, 16 years later. I can't believe, how have you seen it evolve since it started? Well, you know what? The thing about it is, it doesn't matter whether or not you know you have a great relationship with your dad, or if it's estranged, or you mm -hmm. have none at all. The thing about it is, is that everybody wants to have some type of relationship. So we always ask the daughters, even if you're not the one that needs to initiate, just try to get your dad to come and and then work on the relationship. Because we've had dads that have come from all over the world, and once they get there, they're like, you know what? I'm glad I did this, and that's what right. I'm trying to do. So just to make it a, a good event for you to experience what the daddy daughter relationship should be because guess what no matter what the dad is really the first guy in your life so if That's you have true. a bar set high enough where he treats you like a queen then you're not going to settle for anything else I love that and I'm so glad that you brought that up because I actually have a few girlfriends who are estranged from their fathers and they always try to find an event like a family reunion mm -hmm. or a wedding or something where they can meet on neutral ground right. and it sounds like you've set that up I wonder how many reunions you've caused you know over what? the years we've seen dads that have actually come out of situations where they had no relationship at all and have met at the dance for the very first time. But these are like younger kids. But you know what? That's It's very important that we start that relationship. So I, I'm very proud of the fact that the event, and you know, Jason Terry, who played for the Hawks, mm -hmm. he took it to his team where he went, and now he does it where he is now. So it's starting to branch out to, to other parts of the oh, country, which I'm very proud of. Yeah, that's something incredibly, something to be proud of. All right, talk about, is there an age limit, or can people of any age go to the dance? Well, we like to say, you know, we've had, you know, dads who, if, with infant in arms, because they're so <laughs> excited about having daughters, but we've had daughters, you know, as far as like in the, you know, four or five generations deep, you know, 50s and, and, and even higher, because guess what? They still love their dad. Yes. They, you, still, you know, just because you're grown, yes. your, your love for your dad doesn't stop. And you no. know why it's on Father's Day? Because on Mother's Day, here's what y'all do. You have to go by, you <laughs> have to have a dinner, you got to have a car, you got to have flowers. <laughs> but for Father's Day, what do you say? Hey, dad, are you there? Yeah, I'm here. <laughs> Happy Father's Day. Okay. All right, put your mom on the phone. It's like, yeah, come on, we, right. come on, y'all, we need the love. Where is the love? There was one day, one year, when I was like, I guess I'll just get him some more meat and something to drink. You I know, mean, it's like you run out of- If I get one more pair of socks and one more set of golf Ties, balls. Yes. If y'all give me one more set of golf balls, I'm gonna lose it. Right, and it's all about making memories. And it is. so to create an event around making memories, there's that's priceless. Yeah, I mean, I think for us, and for the foundation, you know, and today I got to remind everybody, it's the last day to get tickets oh. because with the Delta Flight Museum, today's the very last day. Go to RyanCameron.org because it is going to be gone. It's going to be sold out. And then they'll be emailing you tomorrow like, I heard that segment. Yes, what do I need to do? I like, know. do it today. And maybe you want to go because you just want to see Ryan Cameron in person. That's okay, <laughs> too. We're not here to judge. Are mothers allowed to attend? Uh, no. Okay. What? We can, I can't. See, I can't. here's what y'all like to do. Y'all <laughs> oh, like to say, see if you know be what? You know, I would like to volunteer. No, you don't. <laughs> you need to let your dad and daughter take a picture and let them tell you about it because you already get all the love there is. We understand there will be another mother. You know, there's no other mother mm -hmm. like you. But guess what? This is a daddy daughter day now. If you have a dad, bring him. Yes. But don't be sitting over there lurking. Right. We all do lurking, okay? Okay. <laughs> okay. No lurking in 2018. <laughs> all right, I like it. I like right. it. You know what? You can set the rules, Ryan. It's your dad. It is, it, is, uh, it is you named after me. <laughs> you can do whatever you want. Would you say this dance yeah. is like any other daddy-daughter dance? It is a daddy-daughter prom. We got corsages. We got boutonnieres. We got the, we got the uh, you know, the gowns. We have everything. This is it. like, it is a, it, you know, Kleenex, if you're out there, 
call me because you need to be sponsoring this thing because it is a tearjerker of of happy tears. Right. Of happy tears. Can I look from the outside in, like through the window? You know or? what? You can go to no? RyanCameron.org and see the video from last year. All right, that's what I'll do, Ryan. But you know what? Next year, why don't you come and why don't you host? I are you kidding me? I'm right here. Live. I would love to. Why don't you come I and host? I would love it? to. Can, it would we, be can, my, can we do that? It would be what? my honor. It really would be. I you would know, love I'm to. I'm just telling you. You know what they say? Be careful what you wish for. <laughs> Didn't know you were going to get a job oh, out of this, well, did you? Well, you know, I'll show Boom, up. Boom, there it is. <laughs> I will. Thank you, Ryan, for being here. Thank I love you. seeing you. And for more information, like you said, this is the last day to get tickets. Right. So what are you waiting for? Watch the show and then get tickets. For tickets and more information, visit ryancameron.org. All right, thank you again, thank sir. You. Love seeing you.